hello guys welcome to coding cafe so in this video we will add a background to our main activity so go to the flying fish view.java class which we created in the previous tutorial and also we create and draw the fish in the last video tutorial so now here we can say private bitmap and let's call this as background image and now inside our flying fish view here after this fish we can say background image equals to bitmap factory dot decode resources comma and uh, before we can say get resources and after the comma we can include the background so we can say or dot drawable dot background the semicolon here and and if I go to the drawable folder then this is our background you can see that now the next thing is to display the score at the top so for that here we can say private Paint. Let's call this as uh, score paint equals to new paint. And now here, after this background image, we can say score paint dot set color color dot you can give it any color you want but I like the white color here because, because it will appear beautiful and now the next thing is to give it size so score pen dot set text size and the size will be 70 now the next thing is to give it some set type face so we can say score pen dot set type face type face dot default or instead of that we can give it default bold okay score paint dot set anti alias to true so the next thing is to uh, display the red heart and the gray heart which is basically the life of a fish i hope you watched the first tutorial in which i show you guys the game preview so let's draw the life of a fish private bitmap and let's call this life equals to new bitmap 2 and inside the flying fish view here after the score print we can say life 0 equals to bitmap factory dot decode resources get resources comma or dot drawable dot heart heart okay so this is the icon inside the drawable folder you can see that here it is up here okay and now if uh, a fish lost a life or destroy a life then for that we can say life1 equals to bitmap factory dot decode resources get resources comma or dot drawable dot heart gray which is this one heart okay so we have initialized the, uh, the background and then the uh, score paint and then the life of a fish. Now the next thing is to display it on the main activity. So what we're gonna do here, uh, here we can say canvas dot draw bitmap background image comma zero comma zero comma null. And then we can say uh, for the text, so we can say canvas dot draw text uh, 
so first we will display the score text so you can say score colon the concatenation sign which is plus but now we do not need this so here we can simply put a comma and then we can give it a from the x axis it should be 20 comma from the y axis it should be at 60 and from here we can give it the score and and now we can draw the the life of a fish which is the gray heart in red heart so here we can say can dot draw bitmap life zero comma from the left it should be 580 and from the top it should be 35 comma null and you can simply copy this line and then paste it here paste it one more time because we have three hertz or you can say three lifetime of a fish so 0 5 80, 35 null and the second will be 0 6 40 and the third will be 1 and from the left it should be 700 and for now also let's change this to 0 okay which is basically the destroy life icon which is this one okay but later in the upcoming tutorials you will change it but for now make sure to uh, write, increase the distance between the hurt or you can say the lifetime of a fish so the first one is 580 and let's change the second one to 680 and the third one to 780 so there is a difference of 100 between these okay when it appears on our main activity let's change this i mean let's move it from the top it should be 10 10 and 10 and now let's run the app so our app is running now successfully and now let's see so you can see that here is the score and here is the three lifetime of this flying fish so yeah that's it for this video and in the next video we will allow this fish to fly here or you can say to move here so in the next video we will allow the fish to fly i mean for the first time you will see that a fish is flying up in the air so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel thumbs up for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now